Bismillah. Now in this lecture we shall discuss some geometric transforms on the images. From the basic graphic uh, lectures we know that we can perform scaling or rotation or turning, shearing towards the horizontal direction or vertical direction or making a vertical reflection or moving from one place to another place, translation. We can all these things achieve by means of a fine matrix. Let us take, uh, for example, if there is an image and if we take the affine matrix so 1, 1, 1 along the diagonal, then it has no change. Therefore, it is we will get an identity image itself. Right, suppose if we want to scale, if we want to uh, double the size in one direction and uh, change the size in another direction, we can specify those things in by SCX and SY parameter of the affine matrix. Suppose the X, SCX is the unit you want to scale along the X direction and SY is the unit you want to scale along the Y direction then I will construct a matrix uh, SX00, 0, 0, SY0001. 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, we shall take a simple image and let us see how this could be achieved. Right, I have taken a MATLAB and let us take the, instead of taking, suppose if I want to achieve this one and see this, I have taken, I have taken an image, cameraman.tiff and along the x direction I want to double the size scaling, along the y direction I want to double this size First, I make an affine transform with the SX00 as the matrix which we discussed now, SX00. Then next one is 0, SY0. Then next row is 0, 0, 001. With this, I first make a transform and I call it as T. And I apply the transform on this image IM which is my cameraman. Then I get an IM1. So now I show the actual image I am and the transformed image I am one. Now let us see this if I run this one so uh, you can see this. This is my original image cameraman.tiff and uh, now this is my scaled image which is double in the x direction and double in y direction. Therefore yeah, if I take this one see that I have made this value equal to SX equal to 2 and SY equal to 2. Right, suppose if I change this value, if I want to make in the XX direction, I want to make 1 and sorry this. I copy this. If I make this one is equal to SX equal to 1, I keep the X direction and Y direction alone, I want to make it as double then first I uh, make a transform with the SX and SY then I apply the transform on this image alright now let us see the image I am one and see this this is my image which is uh, kept in the same X direction but Y alone is uh, doubled Right, this is about the scaling. The scaling we can we can achieve by the other way also. I can use simply the resize command. Therefore, here I use this one. I I am resize which image the image I am by how many times two times. Therefore, the image I am is resized two times and it is stored in IM2 and now if I show the IM2 this is the same scaled image by using the IM resize command I get the same thing where the X value is doubled and the length Y is also doubled right this one is the done by the uh, transform and this one is done by the simple resize command Right, the next one we shall show this one. Suppose if you want to rotate, then this should be cos theta minus, I mean sin theta 0. 
and this one minus sin theta cos theta 0 this will rotate in the clockwise direction now let us apply that one suppose if I want to rotate then let us see this I clear all the memory locations and I clear the command window again I take the image I am read and uh, I take the image uh, camera man dot tiff alright now let us see this first I make a transform cos 35 cos d 35 degree minus sign 35 degree 0 then in the next row in the next row it is sign 35 cos 35 then next last row 0 0 1 ok with this t I apply this on the image and I get image 1 and let us see both the image and the image 1 now you can see this this one is rotated in the anti-clockwise direction because here I put this one is equal to minus sign so this is rotated 35 degree and in the counterclockwise direction if I want to rotate in the clockwise direction then again we shall change this we shall make it as uh, uh, plus and this we shall make it as uh, minus all right I got a transform and I apply the transform on this image and uh, now let us see the image uh, let us see the image a rotated image by transform and see that this time it is rotated in the clockwise direction so I have both the images of the original image and here I put this one is equal to minus sign minus sign so it is in counterclockwise and here I put in the next column that is here I put this one minus sign degree therefore I got it in the a, a clockwise direction so this way an image could be rotated instead of the transform and the rotation I can apply the rotation by direct rotation method see this I can apply by the direct rotation method I am 2 I am rotate I am comma 35 so this will be rotated uh, in the third in the 35 direction in the uh, counterclockwise di direction the same thing if I want to rotate this minus 35 all right then again if I show the figure this is rotated in the clockwise direction therefore as a scaling could be done either by the transform or by IM resize rotation can also be achieved either by means of uh, the transform or by the IM rotate command or by the IM rotate command then next we shall discuss the third transform let us take uh, this one suppose the shear the image in the x direction that is here the amount of the how much you want to shear how much you want to turn that is specified by alpha so now let us see that one so I clear all the memory locations clear clear the command window and now let us again take the image uh, I am is equal to I am read this one camera man dot take right for this rotation I have to apply the alpha therefore let us uh, take the share the image share one this one is equal to which one here rotation scaling and here shear 1.5 both the x y yes let us take this one what is my matlab instead of editor i will i will put it here i will put it here that is i want to share along the take image also all right there's nothing but i close all the figures Clear the memory location. I have taken the image and I want to share along the x in the two units and share in the y direction 1.5. Make a transform and instead of alpha, I put SHY and this one is SHX. You can refer that one in the this is alpha 
in the x direction and this one is beta in the y direction so one yes y and second row is x right one yes y and in the second row is x right we apply the transform t on the image and we show the original image and the shared image in the x direction 2 units and y direction 1.5 units let us run this and see that uh, this is my original image original image and uh, this one is turned by 2 in x and 1.5 in y if it is uh, not clear let us make yes x equal to 2 and we shall make yes y is equal to 1 and let us run this here see this it is turned only along the x direction title is different don't worry about the title this one now let us make this one yes such x equal to 1 and we shall make this one equal to 2 and now let us run this this is turned along the y direction all right the next transform is sharing x y we have discussed now the vertical reflection <coughs> the vertical reflection here we can instead of the identity 1 1 1 if i put here this one is equal to minus 1 then i will get a vertical re reflection if i put minus 1 here where which is x then i will get a horizontal reflection and let us see that one so let us take uh, this one instead of sharing now let us apply the vertical direction so let us make a transform <coughs> so i have taken both the methods so here make a transform so x is equal to 1 and y is equal to minus 1 therefore this is a vertical reflection and we apply this on the image and uh, we see this vertical reflection so this one the actual image y is equal to x both the images are yes yes the actual image i did not show therefore i will show that image also figure i am show the actual image is i am and let us give the title the original image and uh, now we can get a y equal to x reflection either by means of im1 which i got by transform or simply i can use the function flip upside down now you can see that uh, i get the same effect so this is my original image and here you can see that this is my uh, vertical reflection using the transform and this is the same thing which i got by flip upside down uh, command all right now in order to get the horizontal reflection i can make this one is equal to minus one and this one i will make it as same thing and i apply the transform and here this one is equal to horizontal reflection horizontal reflection and here we shall apply instead of flip upside down we shall take a flip left side left to right and therefore this is flipping left to right so now here you will get this horizontal reflection see that one image and this is also the image and this one is the original image this i got by means of the uh, horizontal reflection see that it is pointing face to face and this same thing sorry the same thing i got by means of uh, the flip uh, left to right either you use flip left to right or you use the horizontal reflection by putting minus one in the x we get the horizontal reflection all right so we, we saw almost all the geometric transforms now only the translation that is that is uh, pending we shall see in the next lecture uh, please do comment on the video and please do subscribe so thank you